The context to this design-based inquiry process was for the children to take control of their own learning and to drive their own learning and we wanted to connect outside of just our classroom. So what we asked the children to do was to come up with a problem that would help the uh, Humani children improve their learning in their classrooms and my role really changed throughout that process to more of a facilitator um, and guiding the children um, through their own interests and how they wanted the project to run. Humani is a s small school in Africa and they only have one laptop per about 60 kids and we need to help them with their learning and we need to change that. We love technology so we combined our ideas to create a learning Game Boy called the Game Boy Grade Plus. The Game Boy Grade Plus is a learning Game Boy so we thought of the teacher having the laptop and they transfer the files onto the Game Boy using a link cable so the kids and students can use the Game Boy to learn new things. The next stage was the planning and design stage. We chose to use 3D Creationist to build our model of the Game Boy Grade Plus. This is the D-pad, A and B buttons. This is the link cable port to transfer the lessons. This is the inbuilt fan to cool down the Game Boy. So the key skills behind this project um, were a range of 21st century thinking skills such as problem solving, critical thinking, creativity, uh, working in groups, emotional intelligence and decision making within a real world purpose. This is our 3D prototype which we 3D printed using the 3D printer. Now we have a model we can refine our ideas. So in my classroom now, what I've really noticed um, is the children have a lot more choice and ownership over their learning, and they're not restricted by um, any one particular medium or one particular way of doing things, which has really broadened their creativity, which is something that we've tried to foster in the classroom.